Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Tuba Plan Negative AE, and we're right back where we left off, right in front of this guy who I just talked to just now, Chocolate and he said his name was piece. Conifer, and he says that uh, if I buy supplies from his wife, um, I can purchase mapping supplies from Dirtmouth. So we'll have to do that eventually. First thing I want to do uh, in this is go back up to where I was. Uh, because on the map it shows that whole area to the right. I guess I could go down into the right, um, but I would much rather kind of go up into the right because there's a huge thing uh, up there to the right. I don't know what that is. So I'd like to know what it is. Even even if it's nothing, I'd like to explore a little bit. I um. Because I don't explore enough. I always just plummet without thinking. Not on e not even on purpose. I'm not even plummeting on purpose. It just happens. It's just something I can't help myself. Oh my god, dude. When he, when he gets hurt, you really feel like he got hurt. Holy crap, like the screen cracks and stuff? What's in here? I don't think this is on my map. This is not on my map. What is this? The Pilgrim's Way. Travelers of Hollowness descend through the verdant wilds of fungal groves to the city at this kingdom's heart. There, all wishes shall be granted. All true is revealed. I don't know what that means. Oh! Nope! You know what? Let's see. Let's see. He ain't got shit. What does he do? Fire shit at me? Okay. I don't have what's needed to defeat this guy. I need like some kind of ranged move to defeat that guy. Good to know though. At least I know that he's not defeatable right now. Cause this is literally all I have is <gasps> don't plummet dude what is up with me in plummeting don't plummet I swear to good good lord dude all right we need to carefully ascend up the up these shits these enemies give us coins but like I don't think it's worth it to kind of like farm them unless I really need coins or something uh, because it'll just take forever you guys are just here to fuck me up when I jump. See, like, I'm gonna go for their coins, and then I'm gonna die doing so. Fuck yourself, dude. What's up here? What's up here? Is there another one of those rain? There is just something interesting on each floor, huh? What's up, man? Dude, are you okay? Is there a way to help this man? Is there a way to help this man? This man is very sad. Can I look up at you and you talk? No? Alright, man. All right, well, maybe one day, <laughs> maybe one day we talk to the crying man who's stuck in a hole. Watch his problem be he's so fat that he can't get out of the hole. <gasps> Motherfucker. Heal. All right, here we are, back at where we started before we get the fuck out of here. Done. I'm over here straight killing it. I didn't even see this in my way over here. Oh, and now, I, oh, I can ascend. If I just press up, it's cool. And I think his wife just opened up a mapping shop. But before we do that, before we go up to the town, let's just look and see what we can do over here. Oh, yeah. I failed this somehow last time. 
All you gotta do is jump, Tuba. Uh, I wanted to explore the other way, and then I got like hooked on like this whole adventure. What is this over here? See, I don't know. Hold on. That's the obvious way to go, right? Okay. Let's just see what's inside. Let's just see. It's all about exploration, I guess. Temple of the Black Egg. Okay. He's friendly. Hello there. How delightful to meet another traveler on these forgotten roads. You're a short one, but you've got a strong look about you. I'm Quirrell. That's interesting. I have something of an obsession for, uh, with uncharted places. This kingdom, or this ancient kingdom, holds, my many fans, holds many fascinating mysteries, and one of the most intriguing of them is standing right before us. I saw this in the intro. A giant stone egg lying in the corpse of an ancient kingdom. Is this... And this egg is... Is it warm? It g certainly gives off a unique air. I don't know. Can it be opened? There are strange marks all over it. I do love a mystery. And who knows what other marvels lie even deeper below us. Interesting. So like, this is just an ancient city and we're trying to find out what happened to the ancient city. And I have no idea what this thing is. It has something to pertain to me, because that looks like the alien head that I have up top, right? Doesn't it? Kinda? Looks like, like an alien head that I have up there? I don't know. I'm thinking that that has to do with me. But, uh, there's no promises. I think I'm just gonna, like... This game has, like, a creepy air to it. Right? Just when you, like, you feel safe and, like, there's friends around you. Like, it's almost like, like, there's an eerie feel. Even though you're, like, the cutest thing ever. I am the cutest thing ever. You can come up to me right now and ask me what is the cutest thing ever, and I would say this thing. I gotta watch out for that stuff, dude. It, like, makes a noise in the headphones whenever, whenever it's about to do something. Or whenever it's about to drop a spike. What is up here? I bet you there's a double jump. There's gotta be. You don't just put things in high places and expect there not to be a double jump. I don't think there's a way out if we go this way, right? Okay, there is. Oh, this is... Okay, I know where I am. This is the way where there's nothing. Got it. What the fuck? Oh, I can beat this guy. Oh, I can beat this guy. Holy. Holy fuck. Holy, that hurts. Come on, Vagante. No! Fuck! Go towards him! Damn! You damn right I just defeated that guy. What's going on, man? I'm gonna heal up for a second. You stay right there. Alright, what's going on, dude? Aww. Yo, dude. That was the cutest thing ever. I don't know what, why this guy was guarding it. But freaking yeah, that boss fight was cool, man. He only had two moves, so he was predictable. He had, like, the, the ground pound, and he had the sword smash. And so, once you get him into a pattern of, like, and I was getting hurt way, way more than I was supposed to. I think when you, when he does his ground pound, you're supposed to jump towards him. And when he does his thing, you're supposed to jump away from him. I always jump off those, those things immediately because I feel like a spike is going to come down. Where are we? Okay, see, so he doesn't know what is this way. I should probably go up and get some map. Map supplies. Before I go exploring anywhere, I want to get map supplies. Um, it, There also seems to be like a giant head that almost looks like my head in the middle of the map so I think we head towards that I don't know what that is 
Going this way, there is another room that has like a dome shape. Okay. Organize. Get out of here, Gorgonite. Jesus. Done. Alright. Watch out for these things. Oh, damn. Did you see that? I didn't even know that was there. You're damn right you can't headbutt me. Good news is we're getting all of our juice back that we used to heal ourselves. That like pool of shit. Okay, this guy's the jumper. Oh, and that guy's the runner. Let's get this guy's attention first. Done. Now the jumper. Vagante, man. Literally, that's all I do in Vagante is attack, then move. Attack, then move. Oh my goodness. Vagante has been preparing me for this game. My freaking my whole life oh shit fuck oh my goodness and right as I was like you know what I'm doing pretty well right now <laughs> the first freaking first freaking sign I'm gonna get damaged is when I say how well I'm doing always happens it's always the case does that give me stuff does breaking stuff give me stuff it looks like killing enemies gives me a lot of stuff. There's another one. Do I have to free all of those guys? Where am I? Oh no. Oh no, I don't know where I am. Before I go... Well, just get this. Before I go rescue s these people, what's going on? Oh, oh! This just goes all okay. We're going before those guys get me. I get it. So I that that the part where he doesn't know is just leading back to the elevator. I got it. I got it. We should really go get mapping supplies. That's what I'm gonna do right now. Okay. Too bad I have pretty much info healing. I can see this game getting super difficult if they have like really clever bosses. I also like am OCD and I just break everything even though it doesn't really give you shit. Oh damn. Yo dude. I should have just hit the thing into him again. Come up here. Alright. We're back to where we know. Wait. Oh, down down through here is where we want to go. Well, yeah, okay, so, f gosh darn it, there's so much I want to do. Let's go check out what that boss sign is since we're closer to it. Then we go back up and we get the mapping thing as soon as possible. Oh. Interesting. Okay, so we don't do that. There's just no way to get to it. Interesting. All right, so I guess we just go back up and get the mapping supplies. <laughs> and then we can map, like, different areas. We've already defeated one boss, which is very helpful for us. I also probably want to rest. Or save my progress. I think that's what rest does. Right? Rest saves? It, I hope it does. I do not want to somehow die and lose everything. It's like game over and then you fucking oh I hate that you ever get like corrupted data save files remember those remember when the games used to do that shit and you had to like you, it wasn't just like oh you lost a few hours it was like you lost your entire game right it wasn't like you forgot to save it was like you straight up did I had that happen to like a sims game that I spent like I used to play the sims like a ton when I was a kid I just like building things for some reason. Um, and I remember my, my file got corrupted and I was the most depressed kid, like, ever. Alright, let's go buy some mapping supplies. Also, I want to see what's beyond this well. Hey, 
Mining Town. All right, let's see what see what we got in this mapping area. Also, we should probably check for other things too. Ooh. Shop. Listen. Let's listen. No ma, Jessere. Huh. No ma, Jessere. I like her. <laughs> Come to buy a map, have you? It's really my husband you should be dealing with. But what a surprise! He's headed down below. He'll pop back occasionally to deliver new maps to the store, but I do wish he'd spend a little more time up here. I've not much interest in retail myself. Uh, let's see, what's here for me to sell? <sighs> Bapanada. <laughs> Bapanada. <laughs> what do we got here? Highly recommended if you have trouble finding your way in the maze of ruins below us. Try this charm. It'll pinpoint your location on the map. Incredibly helpful for finding your unfamiliar locations. That sounds very helpful, although it's 220 coins. <gasps> uh, you'll need this quill if you want to update your map with new areas as you explore. It's essential for... Yeah, I need that. That's what I'm going to get, I think. You know, just buy that, because that's an essential. That's something that I'm like, yeah, I need that. Okay. The rest of these are 100. What are these? Bench pin. These pins will mark benches and other rest spots on your map. Useful if you're exhausted and need to find somewhere. Okay. Have you seen the beautiful blue cocoons. I made these pins so you can keep track of them. Cocoons are pretty and delicate. Please be careful. No, I have not seen them yet. Uh, use these pins to mark shopkeepers or any interest, other interesting bugs you find on your travels. Every so often you should pass by and see how they're doing. I'm sure they'd like that. I designed these pins to keep track of the kingdom's hot springs. I haven't visited any myself. I wonder if conifer might take me some time. I'm sure you'd make better use of the pins until then. And she is lonely. I think uh, I think this is the best. Uh, just notifying me when when where I can rest. I mean, eventually we're getting all of them. I don't see why we wouldn't. This isn't really an essential thing for me. I can kind of guess where I am, even though I'll get lost. Let's go ahead and buy this bench pin, <laughs> and then we'll probably rest. Of all the places to end up, we've picked this dreary town. I thought it, I thought it a temporary shop. Then my husband became obsessed with that old ruin. Now he's spending all his time down there. He argues cartography is sound business, but other than you, who's buying? That's true. I mean, you never know, dude. It there, it is a maze down there. What is this? Is this another one? Yeah, I think we go rest on this bench and just kind of save. Yes. Map updated. Oh, does it update on rest? Interesting. Alright. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, hit the like button. Um, I really appreciate it. We'll be right back with the next episode. Um, have a great rest of your day, guys. Peace out.